Adrian Teo of France. And Teo, this is a course that might speak to this skier very aggressive. He's been waiting for the ice yeah, this year. I think if you had one skier that really matches, well, it's him, and he's got the lead up. What I saw in training the last two days with Teo and a lot of the French guys is they were cruising the bottom. They weren't looking for speed in their tuck. They were just kind of, you know, checking it out. So he did his work at the top. Now he needs to look for the tuck. There he is in that aerodynamic position, which I hadn't seen him all week. You know, actually we saw a lot of guys pull up early and tail flying off the terrain there. But saving the legs, you don't often think of downhill as something that will have an effect one day to the next, but saving the legs in this kind of anaerobic sport is critical. Now Teo with some time to find. You know, kind of got offline in that middle section. You can see him. He's trying to cut off the gates here and there. But now he's in a comfortable tuck position, trying to get those skis as flat as possible. When you're on edge, you're breaking. When you're flat, you are screaming. Adrian Teo, little yo-yo down here. But now he's got it. Not much to work with. But this is good position down here. Early on into his tuck. Teo, quick in the air, quick to his tuck into the line, quick enough. It's been a long time since I've seen that happen, where one skier after another comes down with the lead. And that's gonna happen on a new course because they're always trying to save a little for race day. And when you do that, boy, you bring out some special moments. And Teo, on the bottom, rocked in. Третье место, the third place, Adrian Dio, France, France.